Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well, and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can install cPanel on Windows 11, kind of, so let's get right into it. Now, why do I say kind of? Uh, that is because cPanel is not possible to install on Windows platforms. It is exclusively, uh, well, able to be installed on Linux distributions such as Alma Linux, Cloud Linux, Rocky Linux, and Ubuntu, as you can see uh, in the installation steps to the left. Uh, however, there is a workaround which you can use, and that workaround is using a virtual machine. Now, virtual machines are basically programs which run within your system, Windows 10, Windows 11, doesn't matter what. Uh, you can even install VMs on Linux, and it's basically sort of a local um, it's an emulation of a computer. You give it the resources from your system, and then it pretty much creates a virtual machine, uh, as you can imagine. And then uh, you can install whatever you want on there. You can install a fresh uh, installation of Linux, which you do need to do before you install uh, cPanel. So make sure your installation is fresh. And then once you install it, uh, you can then go ahead, open up the console. Uh, for Linux and enter the command you see on my screen right now and that will then go ahead and install cPanel now once you install it you can use cPanel through your Windows machine uh, while it is running on uh, the virtual machine which sort of serves as your server since cPanel is designed to be installed on servers but yeah you can use and edit cPanel through your Windows machine uh, through your web browser you just need your uh, well login credentials and while the server is running you can use it freely through Windows 11 and you can use it also on the VM as well and that is basically it hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys in another video